Oh, and look at that baby. What a great left. And Chapman just hit the canvas. Where's the third and final? John Wayne Park of Australia. Shane Chapman of New Zealand. The Oceanic region being represented here by two of its finest, arguably. And in this tough, tough and brutal tango, Parr has scored three downs against Chapman. Chapman knows it's got to be a knockout in order to have any chance of pulling this off. And John Wayne Parr, knowing that he's ahead on point, still trying to finish Chapman. So there's value for money for you. He could ride this round out, but he's not happy to. He's bringing it on full fat style. Well, Shane Chapman, in fighting terms, is all you can handle and more. But John Wayne Parr has lapped this up. Oh, good, 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 solid punches being thrown by Chapman. And you can hear, oh, accidentally a punch to the back of the head. But the referee says fight on. And the fists of John Wayne Parr are furious. Oh, and the low kick. Shane Chapman has just thrown everything in the book. And John Wayne Parr is still there. This is one tough martial artist. He is the thinking man stylist. And against such unabated, raw, dynamic aggression. And a down he goes, my goodness. It's a knockdown and the look of anguish. And Chapman, I was going to say, still makes the count, but he doesn't. John Wayne Park. What a brilliant victory. Well, that's an impressive win because Shane Chapman is rougher than rough and tougher than tough. And he's still injured from that. And the fists of John Wayne Park, furious. And they hug each other and congratulate each other. Honour in victory and defeat. Such is the spirit imbued by these fighters it's three rounds of pure aggressive adrenaline but once the bell rings at the end they are brothers in martial arts well there is still more incredible K1 World Max action to come but we get a chance to look at the brilliance the demolition job performed here by John Wayne Parr. Oh, and the punch to the floating rib. Just to the side there, both sides. That's a demolition job. Floating rib just above the kidney. I can't even begin to tell you the effect that that has on the physiology of a fighter. You just can see it for yourself. So, John Wayne Parr. Superb.